how to add a new patient for patient files windows desktop click patient files icon open it then click the rm patient files at the top and then click maximize to make it wider and then click new change the last name and first name here to the last name and the first name of the patient and also you could include the middle name and then we would like to add the birthday of the patient and the sex of the patient click personal change the birthday and then the sex and then the civil status you could fill up everything including the address etc or you may not necessarily fill up everything click ok then here you added the sex and then the status of the patient click to back to main screen and then if you want to add a visiting record click visits or outpatient or click new and then here you have buttons at the side we have the complaint the impressions and then the diagnosis you can use those buttons so that you don't need to type all over again these pop-ups here are are customizable and you could change them to fit your specialty we also have another instruction for that click the fetch info when you click that you go back to the rm patient files where you could click the same name and you will be able to bring the age the sex of the patient actually the 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 address as well will be brought in so you don't need to type the address here is the history uh, when you say tap here for shortcuts you could click those and then there are shortcuts there that makes you faster in the physical exam just click the, the pe button again you're brought to another set of pop-up list and then you can just add some more if you like the pop-up list here are all customizable and you can change and improve them in the future as you learn this program so you don't need to add all the 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 physical exam just the pertinent ones and then for the laboratory click it for example with the x-ray bronchomonia became automatic because from in my practice it's one of the most common um, results so I just made a template out of it and then click the meds procedures vaccines which will bring you to this section click number one in the medicines area so you could add the medicines that you've given to the patient and then also number two again choose from the drug list now if you want to make a prescription click the prescription button and then you could click the BR code so that you could make breaks if there are no breaks with your prescriptions and then just edit it you may click file then print report or control R then choose from the fonts then here it's ready to print but for this example you can continue on click that record and click the meds procedures vaccines and then continue with the procedures make use of the pop-ups as well so for example this this is an effect the appendectomy and click the findings and then adhesions noted so go to the vaccines click vaccine given click what part given click next vaccine and then click what part it is and then you could also do the date of what's the next vaccine fees uh, it's also pop up and what you add here will just have a total at the bottom click the certificate and then here you could edit the certificate click file then print report or control r then choose the medical certificate half half size and here you're ready to print the medical certificate click print if you if you like you have a choice from a half size coupon bond or a whole size coupon bond so when you're done click the home icon at the left lower area then it's going to bring you to this question 
you have to check if there is an error or no error if everything is okay click yes and then you go back to the previous screen where you started now you click ok uh, this will eventually save everything as well and then you're going to be brought to the list view where you started and then you could again start a new patient like click new or choose the name of the patient or if everything is done you can again click home at this section and then you save the changes as well thank you very much for watching